Hello YouTube, BB here. Welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. We have a few things to do. Um, we built a laser cutter gun and we got a zapper module from Marguerite's house. Um, we have an outdoor grower bed to do. We have um, the test modular thing to put in the satellite place so we have lots to do we also need to go back now that we have laser cutter go back to the ship now that we can because there's a beacon there um and explore the rest of the ship if i don't get lost in there and drowned because that might happen um <laughs> but yeah let's go here we are and I have the mod. Let's just do this before I forget. Here's the shocky shock thing. Provides increased threat protection. So if something grabs us, we can like shock it, I think. I don't know how to do that in the sea glide, however, but we'll figure it out, I suppose. I have two cells on me. I don't know that I need two. Let me put this power cell back. I don't need more than one on me, and it takes up some space. We don't want to do that. And I don't know that I'm going to need this air bag thing anymore from now on. We're going to be going in the deeper water and it's not going to provide any help, you know. Let me uh, drink some. Here we go. Let's uh, go see if there's any more water to take with us. And I'll eat a few of these. Mm -hmm. So we're all full up on both. Looks like there's water. Perfect. Take those. Leave that salt there. Okay, let's, before we leave, let's check here. Ooh, okay. I was going to go to the, um, to the ship first, but let's do the grow bed. We just need two titanium. Let's go figure out where we want to build it, I guess, in the first place. Hmm. Okay, where is a good spot? Right here, I think. What is that creepy noise about? Okay. And now, do the grow beds, I'm assuming, are... Where are my grow beds? Outdoor grow bed. Aha! The grow bed lets you grow plants and vegetables, providing flavorful options for evading scurvy. Okay, I need more titanium. We should be able to finish it now. Boop! Alright. Now I can... Um... How do I do this? So if I put these ribbon plants in there, then I can cut them and then do the seed thing, right? Yes, okay, I'll do that in a second. We already had three seeds. There they are. Aw. All right, let's get our knife. I don't know how many times you can hit one. Ooh. Awesome. All right, so now we can just go meow. Look at us go. Oh my god, that was perfect. How did I plan that one? Okay. Grow beds are done. Sweet. Okay. Um, we do need, however, something to put in the bioreactor. Okay, I have a few more to put in here. That way at least it'll not go dead while we're gone. Um, and I think we're ready to go. Oh 
Okay, so copper mining, delta, ship. I'll meet you there. Detecting stern of an astronautical salt transco vessel nearby. Vessel name, Mercury 2. Inoperative. Um. Wait, this is another part of the ship. We found another part of the ship. Search this one. When we're done with that, we bring the beacon over here and put it here to search it. That's freaking cool. I mean, it's straight from our house, so we'll see it again. There's something big behind me, though, and I'm not particularly fond of it. No, you stay away. you guys. <laughs> Scary sounds. <laughs> no. Okay. I wonder if there's anything in this piece that's hanging up here. Doesn't look like you can go inside it. Oh my god. So grumpy. Go away. Where is my beacon? It's on the other side. Okay. I feel a little bit of a sense of calm with that shocky thing now. Okay, where's the beacon, dude? Dudes, where is it? We drove right by the damn thing. Cool, cool. Stupid shark. Go away! I'll shock you. I'll do it, sir. Goodness gracious. Okay, here's our beacon. <sighs> All right. Now, do I have... Um, I have some stuff with me that I should not have. I'll leave that there for now. That way I have more space. Let's put this laser cutter on five and go. Okay, so um, we already got the arms of the prawn suits. These cut. Come on, you're wasting my oxygen, dude. What was that? What did we just pick up? Sorry if you guys can hear my dogs, they're freaking out. Where is it? We got something that was a lot different. Looked like a, a cell of some kind. Hmm. I want the storage module really bad. I don't know what it was. Hmm. Oh, here's another one. Reactor rod. 
That seems interesting. All right. Can we go? We could have gone down here before, I guess. These are just pieces of metal. Can we get through here? Oh, we can. Oh my. A PDA! Soul should pay me more to lead these missions. I saved the whole damn crew from destruction. Mercury 2 was nearly obliterated by an immensely powerful energy beam. I don't know any weapon system with that level of capability. The power source to get that kind of range must be, well, otherworldly. Hmm. We got lucky. The energy signature is similar to some of the weaponry meant to counter pirates on mining freighters. The refraction of the beam across the atmosphere? Ryan's belt. It looked like the Northern Lights. Such power. I fired the emergency flares and dumped water from the nuclear core. I think the heat signature confused the weapons tracking for just an instant. I managed Smart a slight cookie. evasive maneuver, and I felt the mercury get rocked by the sonic boom as the nuclear runoff rapidly evaporated. That alone could have taken us out. Definitely asking for a pay raise. <laughs> this is not what I signed up for. My days of risky missions should be behind me. Ah, but what the hell? I still got it. Even if it was luck. Hopefully, whatever didn't want us on the planet doesn't mind when we leave. Makes sense. Okay. Was that all in here? Cool. Okay. Ooh, stuff! Okay, I need to watch my oxygen. Ah! Ooh, scary. Thanks. Speaking of, probably should drink that water. Bungu. I need to watch my air. I know that there's all kinds of things I can scan, you guys, but that's really not very interesting for you, I wouldn't think, when it's just the plants, you know? Okay, ooh. back in. <laughs> All right. Um. Wait, what was that? Okay. Yeah, see, these are just flowers and stuff. And I hope you guys can't hear my dog howling. Metal salvage. If you can, I'm so sorry, but I have three puppies and they're super sad because they think everyone has left them because I have my door shut and everybody else in the house is gone today. <laughs> Parallel processing unit. This seems important, yeah? One of three? Okay. Um, oh God, I probably should not do this. I'm gonna get so super lost. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's the fish tank! Hallelujah! Give me a plant, please. Metal salvage, there's a door. Oh, that's so cool. PDA. Oop, oop. My instincts are never wrong. Stephanos has always been overly cautious. He hates taking risks, which I suppose is understandable when you're in the back end of the galaxy. But no risk? No reward. Elliot finds evidence of alien architecture on a completely uncharted planet, and he expects me to ignore that? <laughs> Orion's belt, I would be an absolute fool. We've done some scans, and while there aren't a lot of mineral resources on this planet, there is decent biodiversity. Teams go out in the morning. This should be a significant specimen and sample hall for biopatenting, which will be split among the crew as part of the discovery clause. 
And let's see, Stefano, so never would else complain when they have a few more soul transgov credits in their uniform pockets. They'll learn to trust my instincts at some point. Hmm. So this is definitely, Diana is the captain, obviously, um, of this ship that went down. Interesting. Okay, I do need to find air, though. We came out of there. There's an up, though. Oh, thank God. Okay. Come on. Hurry, hurry. <laughs> hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh my gosh, this is so super slow. I hope there's... Okay. Oh, this is where I was. All right, shortcut. Got it. Okay. You know what? Since we're right here, I'm going to just go fill up all of my air. And we're going to start again. Whoop. Perfect. I might as well just drop off some things then too, huh? Let's go again. Okay, except this time we'll go up. So we came out somewhere. Okay. Where did we come out? There's got to be a hole in the freaking wall. Was it here? Oh. Eh. Thought I saw a PDA. Okay. So there was another door we could cut down below. But I'm going to go up here for a moment. Well, here's the door. Let's just do it. <laughs> Laser cutting time. Do 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 do. <laughs> Skippity do. Blah 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 blah. Let up. This does take a while, honestly. Ooh. What are they? They're more potatoes. I don't need the potatoes, honestly, you guys. Here's the grow bed. Cool. If we hadn't gotten the grow bed before. There's more potatoes. I really don't think I need them, though. Is there another PDA or something in here? I don't see anything. Oh, right in front of me. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is every xenolinguist dream. <sighs> I mean, I was helping with the planetary scans, and there are possible unknown structures on the surface. This could set my career up for life. Nice. The images are a little degraded coming through the atmosphere, but it looks like intentional and complex architecture, which means civilization, and civilization so means dun, 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 language. Oh, man. And now, most of the crew wants to get home. I, I understand that, but this could be a defining discovery. I'm definitely going to put a bug in Diana's ear about going to the surface so I can take a team to explore. I desperately hope this pans out. Oh, I can't wait till we get into communication range with Soul again. Layla and the kids would love to hear this. I mean, it's rough being away from them so long, but this might just make it worth it. I'll be able to give them so much more. Oh, that makes me sad. Because they obviously did not make it. Okay. Let, go. Let, let me out. Okay, we're going back up. And this way now. I really do need an oxygen plant, however. Would be nice. Okay, that just kind of goes around. What's this? Ooh. Okay. Thank you. PDA. Orion's belt this all went sideways. Uh oh. How could I have known that so much would go wrong? I failed my crew. No. I don't fail. 
I didn't get into this position by being a failure. It's this desolate land, frigid, cursed. Between these tunneling creatures and the strange sickness that a few of the crew are showing symptoms of, oh, I guess I can do this. Can we I? have to leave at first light tomorrow? We are prepping for a rapid takeoff. We can't take chances with the vibrations drawing the tunnelers, so we're skipping the systems check. Risky. Skipping but I have faith check. in myself and the crew of the Mercury. Is that why they crashed? Landing this thing was practically a miracle, though. But we have to get out of here. Maybe the weapon is to keep people away. But if we leave, it'll let us go. I have to leave the quarantined crew in the cave behind. We will be back for them. But we can't risk an unknown infection spreading through the Mercury. Okay. We're packing survival kits for them. There's only enough surplus for about two weeks. I'm telling them that we will come back. But I don't think I can land here safely. Twice. Ooh, I so they're this. not coming back. Oh my gosh, that's terrible. But I have to leave them behind. I can't risk the entirety of the Mercury. There was something I could scan that I went right by, but I don't know what it was. Oh, the fish. There we go. A red feather fish. Metro salvage. Oh, have I been down there? Um, I don't think I can be. I have been. It's okay. <laughs> we got more air. <laughs> Works for me. Okay. So, I think that's about it in here. I feel like maybe, oh wait. Can I cut this? Oh, I guess I can't. We just can't go in there. Weird. Okay. Got it. God, there's some angry, angry big, big monsters out there right now. Oof. So disorienting. Oh. Okay. So, ha. Okay, wait. Is there a, please, there's a plant? Okay, thank you. Okay. Boy, the battery in this thing just goes away fast. Come on, I really don't have a lot of air. Okay, this has gotta be like the last area. We've kind of gone through everything, I think. Okay. Ooh. Okay, is there a plant though? Oh god, there's this there's a lot more shit. But the plant I need a plant. Okay. I might die. I might die. Oh, what was that? A nuclear reactor. I'm gonna die. I'm alive. Stefano saved me. The Mercury attempted an emergency takeoff and everything seemed fine. I was helping the bridge crew with the emergency takeoff since the crew is, well, was shorthanded mm -hmm. because of everything. Yes, I heard the sound of metal tearing and for a split second, everything was tinged bright green and unbearably hot. Oof. Then I saw daylight and I was looking down at the ocean and ice. The strongest wind I've ever felt roared in my ears, ripping through the ship. People went flying out the side of the Mercury, so much of... screaming and chaos. Emergency. I was lucky. I had just clipped into my sea tinker. Stephanos came out of nowhere, like a malaika, an angel. an angel. I felt his rough, calloused hand grasp mine with a 
gentlest of urgency. It felt like time slowed, he said. I gotcha. Just follow me, Ella. I don't know how, but he used an emergency tether to drag me to the nuclear reactor core, the strongest bulkhead in the ship. We hit the water and everything went black. <gasps> He's sleeping. I think he might have hit his head. I'm exhausted. The adrenaline has long since worn off and my body aches. I think I might have fractured the rib. I'm gonna shut my eyes for a bit. When I wake up, I'll figure this out. I'll save us. Um... Where is the ship? There it is. I'm not gonna make it. Well... Oxygen. Yes, I know. We just got some synthetic fiber, you guys. I think I did it. I think I did it. Maybe? I think? Did I lose it? Yes! We got synthetic fiber! Okay, so obviously the first thing we do... Oops, I ate rotten. Don't do that, kids. That's a bad idea. Oopsie! <laughs> okay. Um, anyways... Vital signs stabilizing. Okay. We have synthetic fiber, which means we can do our depth charge, our, our deeper, for the, the truck. I cannot speak, good lord. I think I got everything in there. I, I scanned the fish tank. I got the nuclear reactor. I got a whole bunch of reactor rods and two, um... What of whatever those things were called, damn it. Um, we got reactor rods. Right here, the parallel processing unit. I don't know what we need this for, but I'm assuming we'll need it at some point. We have two out of three. Maybe the third one is in the other part of the ship that we saw on the way here. Um, I still have oops, I still have plenty of room. So technically we can actually go to the other part of that ship. So let's get our beacon and go. I'm fairly certain I got everything. If, oops, there we go. If I didn't and you've played this before, will you please let me know that I should probably come back here? Okay, so, oh crap, I'm turned around though. Did we come from, well, that's home, so we came from this way. Mr. Shark, you stay there. You're gonna be naughty, aren't you? Ow. Ha ha! <laughs> I love that thing. Okay, so we're just gonna keep heading this way because that's the way um, in which we came towards the beacon for the one piece of the ship. I wish when the PDA sees the ship wreckage or whatever, it would say, oh, there it is right there even. Okay. Oh, shush. How do we get in you? Uh, phrasing. Aha! Looky here. Okay. All right. I think I have two more spots. Okay, that's fine. Um, we'll put that and that in there. I hope that there's none of those shitheads out here. Mm, let's put you on three. Wow. OK. 
Okay. This thing is like almost out of juice. <sighs> How exciting. Exploring shipwrecks, you guys. Oh. That shadow behind me scared the shadow that goes is going like this on the pole, it scared the crap out of me. Oh, hello, thank you. Don't mind if I do. Okay. Um so we can go up. Oh, I don't have one of those. I don't have anything to move those boxes. That looks like just metal salvage anyway. Power cell. Always a good thing. There's something out there that... Oh, there's the third one, you guys. I'm so smart. <laughs> I thought so. Don't eat my shit. Now I just need to build the test override module. Then I can disable that satellite tower. Yeah. For Marguerite. That's what she wanted us to do, right? That sounds much bigger than those little black things. Alright, before we go in there, I thought so. Okay. Oop, I thought I could go around there, but I guess I can't. Let me... Of, okay. Distractions! It wants, it really, really, really wants me to um, scan those metal uh, things. I can only do repairs in spurts. That's so inefficient. It's so inefficient. The larger tools seem to set off seismic activity nearby. A crew came back telling stories of gigantic worms burrowing in the ice. Oh. I don't know what they're all going on about. They were hypothermic and frostbitten because mm. they walked back to avoid angering them. The ice shelf is probably a bit unstable and they got disoriented or something. To borrow from Diana. Orion's belt, thermocouplings, are not meant to be worked on in 20 minute spurts. <laughs> if we break the process, we'll break the ship. <sighs> but it's nice to hang out with Yasmin while we wait for the rumbles to stop. I hope she doesn't mind all my questions. I love hearing her voice. Oh. Her face lights up, and she's got the most expressive eyebrows. They're practically acrobats. <laughs> the way she looks when talking about nuclear engineering is the same way I look at my grandmother's domades. Oh. The woman never sits down, though. She told me that she used to do decathlon in college, and I can believe it. She's like a bouncy ball, just all over the place. She makes rounds on the ship every day to see if people need help. Hmm. I should do something nice for her. Aww. She's always helping everyone else. I wish I had a fraction of her energy. <laughs> How sweet. Okay. Oh, God. Um, so I feel like we got the thing that was most important, which was that. Um, first off, right off the bat. Okay, we can't go through there. Sorry, I'm disoriented a little bit. Okay, so let's go through here like I had planned. We can go down. What is this? Okay. Um. Cool. I don't know what this is. Finding stuff, guys! We're finding stuff! Go home and build the depth module for um, another parallel processing thing. Eh. Cool. We have more than enough to. Oh, this is glass. We can't even. Okay, here we go. Alright, um... 
metal, salvage. Another battery. Okay, this is out. I don't think I need to go out quite yet. We're not necessarily in danger yet. <laughs> okay, I don't think that there's anything else in here. Did I come this way? I don't believe I did, no. Another battery. Okay, let's go up now. We went down before. It's a laser cutter, okay. I should go get a, the plants real quick. All right, Oop. back through and up. Okay, another laser cutter food for days. I feel like that was all we needed was, and that's all that's going to be here. Maybe some more PDAs, but I mean, we'll search. I don't feel like there's anything else to, to scan though. I guess I don't need that out though because the little thingy will tell me. Oh, I kind of don't want to go out without Hug the ship. I don't trust you. <laughs> okay. Let me out. <laughs> God. What is that? Oh my gosh. stuff too <laughs> look at all of it um let's drink we don't quite need to eat yet okay so we've explored the ships so let's go back now that i know we have a, at least one synthetic fiber let's do the depth module in the sea truck so that we can go deeper to get more spiral clippings to do more things we also need to build the test override module um, now that we can do the parallel processing unit. Wait a minute, how much, what does that take? Oh, see, we can build it. Yep, we can build it. Sweet, okay. I will meet you guys back at home. We are home. Welcome oh. aboard, Captain. <laughs> Oh, I guess we need to get back. Can I get into the storage of... Oh no, the module's down there. Well, oh, shit. I need to get the stuff out of you. How do I... Can I get in you if you're not connected? Yes, I can. Ooh, he's dark. Perfect. Okay. Woo! Here we go. Okay, so now we need ruby and plus enamel glass, but I also need that. What? Oops. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Glass. Boom, now we can do it. Ah, I'm so excited. Okay. <sighs> so now we have to go back to 
the modification thing, I think, is, yep. No! Okay. So how much depth, we're at 300 currently, so let's see what this does for us. 650 feet! Woo! Yes! That's awesome. Okay. I feel more prepared now for the tasks that we are about to be doing. Um, let's make the parallel processing unit. Gold, silver, and table coral. Yes. Okay, so now we can make the test module thingy and go back to Delta. Perfect. Look at us go doing things. What does it take to make the fish tank? That is the next question. Um, is the fish tank in the uh, builder tool? Probably. There it is. No, that's the nuclear bioreactor. Oh, we have to make the vehicle bay or vehicle upgrade console thing. No, wait, we already have that, don't we? Alien containment, five glass and two titanium. I might be able to do that. I think I can make the um, fish tank now. Do we want it? Uh, can I put it right here? I don't know. We'll see. Mm. Oh, God. Oh, it's huge. Oh my God. An aquarium just for looks or your own personal sushi factory. Sushi. <laughs> nice. Okay, so we need to build a hatch for this, right? Something to open, like, otherwise, how the heck am I going to get inside of it? Oh, I need quartz and titanium. Crap, I think I just used all of it. Let's look. Now we can collect creature eggs, you guys. Oh, I'm in my fish tank. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. Okay. Now, collecting creature eggs while we explore is a fantabulous idea. Okay. This is our wonderful room. How is the bioreactor doing? Uh, let's go see if our grow beds are doing well. Let's go see. They should be all grown by now. Like, oh, look at this, you guys. Look. Okay, I should be able to, like, get two chops out of one, at least. And then take it. And then just put... Oops. And just put to back I mean I guess I could grab two more dang it I keep doing the wrong thing there aha look at you okay I'm really nervous about this so let's one two So it's three, okay, that's fine. I got three out of one, which is fine. Two, three, one, two, three. Okay, so now, awesome. Cool beans. And let's go put the rest of these in the bioreactor. The fish 
fish tank. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> you got a water too. Okay. Things are happening, you guys. Perfect. Okay. Things are happening. Okay, so next episode, I think we're going to go to Delta with the test thingy and put it in the um, satellite so it disables it or whatever like uh, Marguerite wanted us to do. And then maybe go probably go talk to her, I would assume, which is perfect because I also, now that we ha can go 650 feet down with the sea truck, I want to go back to that area that was near her last known whereabouts um, and go deep down into that red area and really try to explore and see what we can find down there. So that will be next episode. I hope you had a good time with me today. Um, if you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for future content and I will see you in the next one. Bye!